What's going on, you guys? This is Will here, and welcome to Reincarnated. This is a kind of a fan game, but also kind of like a unofficial remake of the first Garden of Ban Ban game. This is actually made by the uh, the same guy who made um, Indigo Park, whose uh, name escape. Oh, Unique Geese. That's his name. It says at the bottom there. But yeah. Um, so yeah, he pretty much remade Garden of Ban Ban, like the first game, to, uh, I guess, look better, I guess. To uh, make it actually look like a horror game, kind of. So yeah, I, um, I figured, you know, I've... I've had this, I've wanted to try this out at some point, but I've just, you know, had other games I wanted to play first, but yeah, I figured I would check this game out. So yeah, let, let's do it. Oh. oh boy, we got chapters. Okay. Okay. Oh. Oh my God, dude. Hold on. Hold on. I got a me First of all, oh my god, this all this already looks better than the than the real game. But hold on. Uh I'm gonna have to back out for a minute. Cause uh Oh my god, these graphics look awful. I'm gonna turn some of my settings up. I'll be right back. Alright. Oh boy. Alright, so now it's like this game. All right, it looks better now, but oh god, it's a little laggy is is the problem now, but all right. I don't think if this is like the first game, Ban Ban game, that this should only be like 15 to 20 minutes, I think. So Let's see, lend a helping hand. There's the uh Oh my gosh. Read Oh my gosh, this this looks like an actual kindergarten. Okay, it's like no hate towards the uh the real Ban Ban games. Like I I do like the Garden of Ban Ban games, but they um I don't know, it doesn't feel like you're in a kindergarten though. It sometimes feels like you're just in some random facility. If you can dream it, you can do it. Jumbo Josh says, eat your fruits and veggies to grow strong. Okay, I was going to say, can I pick that up? Oh, we got a flashlight. Eat. Hey, it's the same flashlight sound effect as Indigo Park, I think. <laughs> um, eat plain foods, bread, cream, white sauce. Os pick. Keep your body ticking. And a helping hand. Okay. Oh wow, where we have an actual cafeteria, guys. Oh, is this a note? What's this? Rob, consider this letter. Consider this my letter of resignation. I'm in 27 years of being a cook, and I have never had such a miserable experience. There is no other kitchen staff, so cooking, cleaning, planning, everything was up to me. The only way I was, the only way I wasn't in charge, or sorry, the only thing I wasn't in charge of was ordering supplies. So I was cooking the same food every day. These kids are going to get sick. <laughs> there is no nutrients in the food we serve. I don't even know how this is legal. Not to mention the kids being so So brutal and mean. Jumbo Julie? Jumbo Julie is not exactly flat a flattering name. I know I'm overweight, but I can't handle hearing it 200 times a day. <laughs> screw you, Rob. Screw Jumbo Josh and screw this school. Julie Winters. Jumbo Julie Winters. All right. Got uh we got some jewelry lore there. Oh. I think I just picked up a key card. 
I, is the drone in this game, I wonder? Wait, that wasn't there. Wait, this wood wasn't... Wait, am I crazy or was this blood not here before? Oh, I, I recognize that hallway from the main game. For the safety of your child, please check in at the front desk. Thank you. Alright, uh... Share your smile. Let's play. Okay, I got a key to something. What's this? I want to read. Thank you. Kindergarten and daycare center repair request form. Okay, this is just a drone repair request. Okay. Okay, what were the keys for? They for here? Bro, I see some eyes. Hello. Oh my god. You can tell this is... Yeah, you can kind of tell this is made by the same guy who made Indigo Park. Like, this bird... This bird looks like the bird from Indigo Park, kind of. Or has the same kind of look to it. Okay, yeah, I was gonna say... I, uh, I actually... Oh. I, um, I actually watched a video. Right before playing this, I actually watched a video on, um, the first Ban Ban game, just so I could properly compare this. Hey, chicks, welcome to my nest. Before you enter, please take off your shoes and put them in the slots on the left. Be sure to follow the rules and have fun. All right. Right, all right. Okay, this music is very loud to me. Uh-oh, Apila lost her eggs. Can you find all six of Apila's pretty blue eggs? Put the eggs in their nest for an amazing surprise, okay. Okay, so yeah, it's it's just like the game. Okay. Oh, so we actually have to place it in the nest. And, um... I think he... Yeah, he, don't you have to place it in, like, the bird's mouth in the game? <laughs> okay, that's two. Oh, oh, oh. That's three. Four here. Do I dare go in here? There's probably another egg in here, isn't there? Share your smile. <laughs> My god. <laughs> I see those eyes. You're probably gonna back up. Either you're gonna back away or you're gonna chase me out of here. I'm taking bets. Which do you think? <laughs> well, the people who said back away won. Congratulations. Okay, yep, okay. As I suspected, what does this say? Pretty bird, pretty bird, pretty bird, pretty bird, pretty bird. Okay, I just said pretty bird a bunch of times. <laughs> oh, man. This is actually kind of scary. Man. I wasn't, like... I, like, I, I wasn't expecting this to actually be scary. I was just expecting this to be, like, you know, the exact same thing, but, you know, the with more polished textures and stuff. I, I was not expecting this to actually be scary. But honestly, I, but honestly, he did a great job with this game. This this game does look good, despite the fact that it's a little laggy on my computer. 
What's this? <laughs> Bird. Dear God, the lights are out. Oh, no, they're not. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Where does that go? I got a key card, but I'm not sure what it opens. Maybe it opens this? Oh, it can open vents. Okay. Kind of like an um, security breach, kind of. There we go. All right. God, I'm scared. Okay. <laughs> oh, is this supposed to be where you, um, listen to your superior? You are nothing. <laughs> I like, <laughs> I like, I, <laughs> oh my God. That, that looks like, okay. I think that's supposed to be, um, the remastered version of what Ban Ban looks like. <laughs> yeah, I swear, oh, he looks like some. He looks like somebody from a movie. I I can't think of who exactly, but this this looks like somebody from a movie. <laughs> but anyway, I'm assuming this is supposed to be the um. Let's see the part where the bird chases you. Where you go over the uh, the void that I'm pretty sure is supposed to be the ball pit. Okay. I wasn't sure if I w was able to parkour up there or not. Alright. But I could parkour here. What's this? Apila's Nest expansion progress. The new expansion expansion to Apila's Nest has been successful so far. As requested, we're installing the new playground piping before working at the ball pit. We've also got a team working on the new hallway that connects the classrooms to the new area. Kids should be able to climb from the current play area into the new ones via the pipes, but the hallways will be an alternate route to the new area. The overweight crew installed some platforms that the kids will be able to climb onto when the ball pit, in the ball pit. But I have to wonder, how did they manage to, how did they even manage to install them? Of course, we won't actually put the balls in until we have the, all the construction done. But that pit seems to go on forever. I know there's... I know there's lower levels to the facility that I haven't seen before, but how is it even possible to have a pit that deep? What else is down there? And why are we covering it in thousands of plastic balls? <sighs> I've noticed sometimes it's better not to question stuff here, so I'm just going to keep my mouth shut. Better to just do my job and go home. Regardless, the new area should be finished in a couple of weeks, assuming we don't run into any other mishaps. Don Duggan? I don't know how you say that. I'm sorry. Dick, daytime construction supervisor. All right. 
Let's get going. Can I like climb? Is this like Minecraft where you like walk into the ladder and climb it? No. Oh. Oh no, which way? Uh, I'll go left. Oh, it's literally just, okay. I don't think it even mattered, okay. Okay. Insert lore here. Okay. Oh, gosh darn it. I gotta... Ah, it's fine. It wasn't that far. All right. Oh, this way. Who are you? Who are you? Where's the bird? Is he still chasing me? Oh yeah, he is. Or she. Alright. What door? What door? Oh, this door. Oh, 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 oh! I think I died. Dang it. Oh. Oh. Oh, hi. Hey. How are you? Okay. Oh. All right. That's it. All right. Thanks for playing. Check out... Check out how the game was made on Unique Geese's YouTube channel. I had a blast working on this project. In less than a week, I went from zero game experience to a working game. Thank you so much. All right. All righty, you guys. Well, that was reincarnated. So this game was pretty good. I thought it was. I thought it was a good like remake kind of of a uh, Bam Bam. I, but yeah, I thought this was a really good fan-made, like, Garten of Ban Ban 1. But yeah, this was this was really good. I, I liked this a lot. So yeah, that's gonna just about wrap up for this video. Let me know if there's any other... Any other games you would like me to play. Yeah, I, w I would love to um, maybe start a series where I check where I check out some, like, FNAF fan games or something like that, I think would be cool. But yeah, let me know. Um, but yeah, I got some cool series coming out very soon. But yeah, overall, this was a really cool game. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching this video. Hopefully you all enjoyed this one. If you did, please leave a like, subscribe for more, and I'll catch you all next time. Peace.